In this video clip, we're going to see how we can set a motion sensor or motion detection for CCTV a DVR. Now, I've go back to a main menu, and I've got several options here. But I've go to alarm, motion detect. Just click on that, and I can now start selecting the cameras, um, the channel input. I can go channel one, channel two, channel three, or I can just simply select and say all. So I go to channel one. Now, if I click. If I take this, enable, then all of a sudden you can see all these um, menus are sort of editable. If I unclick it, now you can't change these values. So I click it, that means I'm enabling the motion sensor. Um, so that's how you enable the motion sensor. Now you could um, either decide that to be um, a high, lower, or highest, or different different parameters are there. Now again, you got the period. Um, if you click on set, you can either um, for example, you can do channel one for do motion recording from four o'clock to seven o'clock, and the rest of the time it will be sort of recording continuously. You know that sort of thing. You can set it on here. Um, here you got um, nice options where you can, if you click on that, every time it triggers a motion, it's going to pop up a message saying that motion triggered. Uh, if you click on that, it's going to it's going to boss. It's a bosser, and then if you click on that, it will send a mobile. A report to your mobile phone and here send email so if you click on that every time it triggers a motion it's going to send the email via SMTP server which we'll learn later um, or you can do FTP upload so that will upload straight to your server